Hello, today I'm joined by Dr. Lee from Huawei. Uh, welcome, Dr. Lee. And we're going to be talking about Wi Fi 6. And principally, we're going to be talking about the biggest challenges facing enterprises when it comes to industrial digital transformation and the types of solutions that can help enterprises address those challenges. So, Dr. Lee, uh, let's talk about Wi Fi 6 challenges, solutions. Industrial digital transformation faces many challenges. One of the challenges lies in many industrial terminal types and over 2,000 control protocol in the industrial field. As a result, it is difficult to obtain and process device and the terminal data in real time. Another challenge is integrated industrial ICT infrastructure, especially Digitalized information of a manufacturer is not comprehensive or accurate enough, and the planning accuracy and the timeless are not high, so it's resulting in high production costs and a small efficiency improvement. To address these challenges, next generation ICT must be urgently integrated into the campus to implement more timely interactive and consolidated information detection, transformation, and processing. In this way, it is feasible to improve flexible manufacturing efficiency, reduce operation costs, and enhance innovation capability in the industry production campuses. So in response, Huawei has launched the Cloud Campus 2.0 solution. This solution uses Huawei's latest generation L engine Wi-Fi 6 technology, which features gigabit wireless for terminals in both uplink and downlink, and support seamless access of various types of IoT endpoints, driving industrial products towards all wireless and OIP transformation. Many creative features of this solution are generated beneficial in industry manufacturing environments. For example, Huawei's unique lossless roaming technology ensures faster roaming of AGVs. AGV is the automatic guided vehicles without the packet loss or service interruption. IoT anti-interference technology ensures efficient traffic transformation for IoT endpoints and the intelligent HQ's technology make assurance for bandwidth hungry and low latency services such as automated optical inspection, AOI, and wireless AR assistant remote retentance. So all these creative technology features like Huawei's Wi-Fi 6 L engine, this new brand product, has a very high performance and very good useful for the industry users, especially for the manufacturing environment. So that's the point why we think it is very good for the industry for nowadays. Thank you, Dr. Lee. There's obviously a lot of challenges and thankfully there's also a lot of technical solutions out there. Now you mentioned two Huawei innovations, um, Air Engine Wi-Fi 6 and Cloud Campus Solutions. But let's talk about Air Engine Wi-Fi 6 first. I think it's worth pointing out that this product won the best enterprise Wi-Fi network product at the Broadband Wireless Broadband Alliance Award, so congratulations for that. Uh, but perhaps you could tell us what are the special features of, of uh, Air Engine Wi-Fi 6 and perhaps use cases and commercial deployments. Yes, uh, thank you. So uh, Huawei's L engine Wi-Fi 6 has been used in many areas. For example, uh, Shanghai Automotive Industry Corp, uh, this is the largest automobile company in China, has deployed Huawei Wi-Fi 6 in its new factory in Ningde City. More than 2,000 intelligent terminals, 2,000 two sensors, and 500 AGVs are connected through Wi-Fi 6 in this wireless factory. Not only in industry manufacturing, Huawei Wi-Fi 6 has been applied in many other fields. In education, self-net, e in German, 
turned to Y Huawei Wi-Fi 6 solution for their Scott Scott uh, Scottgard dominate network. In retail, Amazon based the Song Mix applying the Huawei L Intim Wi-Fi 6 to make better use of the emerging services such as asset management and AGVs. So let me take AGVs as an example to show Huawei Wi-Fi 6 works. An AGV needs to communicate with the console in real time to report its status and receive new action introduction. So if such communication is interrupted, the AGV has to stop until the communications is recovered. So communications interruption is most likely to happen when an AGV looms between the multiple APs. This is because common Wi-Fi roaming cannot prevent packet loss. To overcome this difficulty, we have introduced the signal switching mechanism of the cellular network. We can pre predict the roaming direction of AGVs and steer them to roam to the most appreciated AP. Meanwhile, during the roaming of AGVs, the user data sent to AGVs will be cached by the network and then be replaced to AGVs after roaming successfully, so as to realize the zero packet loss roaming. So it is the, the typical case for how Huawei L Engine Web 6 works. So it is clear? Yes, thank you very much for that. Very useful and detailed explanation. And we also talked, didn't we, about Cloud Campus 2.0. Now, you, with the help of Wi-Fi 6, you've upgraded to, obviously, from the original version to 2.0. Perhaps you could just tell us about the application of the new versions, applications that are possible, and how it differs from the previous version. Okay. The ideas for Huawei Scout Cameras to zero solution comes from such ideas. The ongoing digital and the cloud transformation of the enterprise bring new challenges to cameras network. Especially connecting all things breaks connectivity boundaries. Service migration onto cloud breaks campus boundaries and cloud management breaks network management boundaries. To keep up and stay compatibility, enterprises will need to adopt new old network architectures. We call it the cloud architectures. So Huawei has fully upgraded its cloud camera solution from 1.0 to 2.0. This latest solution builds on Huawei's autonomous driving network. We call it ADN, autonomous network uh, architecture. Uh, there are some Huawei innovative products and features, such as the industry fastest L engine Wi-Fi 6, one of the kind cloud engine as optical electrical hybrid switches. Industry first 5G enterprise loader net engine 5G AR and 5G SD1 technologies. With these innovations, this solution is good for enterprise who look up for the campus network, featuring unified access, one hop to cloud, and one stop AI O and M. The first benefit of this solution is to unified access. The solution helps customers build a fully wireless campus network characteristicized by all gigabit access, fully wireless IoT, all optical transport, and all gigabit migration to cloud. The second benefit is the one hop to cloud. This solution is a good choice to build a designed campus network that delivers intelligent experience, consistent user's policy, a deterministic application assurance, and a secured IoT access. So the, the third benefit is one-stop AIONM. This solution is helped to build a cloud campus network can support tens of thousands of branches and millions of network elements and features, automatic deployment, service provision, and application optimizes across the LAN and the WAN. So we can see that all these benefits can help the campus for the all kinds of the enterprises 
to build a, a better con connection and a better network for the network for the the enters for the all kinds of the technology using the together integrated for wild wireless and IoT merging to one network and it is cloudish management to reduce the capacity OCAS for the owners of the enterprise. Yes, thank you. These features and benefits sound very compelling for enterprises. Maybe can you tell us about any commercial deployments uh, so far for Cloud Campus 2.0 and perhaps how you're promoting that with, with your partners, how you're getting it out there into the market? Okay, yes. Uh, for the enterprise, uh, we must uh, cooperate with our partners together. So Cloud Campus to zero point uh, has been widely applied uh, in education, uh, government, manufacturing, and the public services, such as the Xiamen University, Malaysia Campus, uh, is City Mesh, the fourth largest telecommunications operator in Belgium, and uh, Huo Shenshan Hospital. Uh, it is very famous for the COVID-19 hospital in Wuhan, China, etc. You know, uh, here an example. Uh, Huo Shenshan Hospital has designed specifically to treat COVID-19 patients, uh, which was uh, completed in just uh, 10 days. Yeah. So drawing global attention, the speed of the development and the purveying of the hospital's information network was impressive. Huawei completed installation and the commissioning of the old network equipment and delivered the network within three days with Huawei Cloud Campus 2.0 solution. So together with the partners, Huawei provides customers with the best in-class solutions and services and also bring management and the business benefit to partners. Firstly, uh, Cloud Campus 2.0 is not strongly bonded with the hardware and the software. It can be therefore easy to mitigate from, from the networks of the other architectures, which maximize the value of the existing instructions. Secondly, in addition to flexible uh, migration at the device level, Cloud Campus 2.0 also provides a flexible business models, such as a license-based uh, illustrate hardware performance control. You can also upgrade the software measurement from the basic to advanced measurement by using the software package. And the third, Cloud Campus 2.0 implements network service providing through cloud measurement, which can reduce the cost of MSP deployment and the O&M. The self-operating business models can bring 100% service revenue to MSPs. So we think for the those, uh, especially for the MSP, they can use Huawei's Cloud Campus 2.0 to deploy the network and provide provide the best service for their customers to build the different, the campus network for different kind of the enterprise customers. So thank you. This is the, the three benefit that I mentioned. Thank you, Dr. Lee. It's been great talking to you and hearing about all these advances associated with Wi-Fi 6. It's been very good talking to you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.